I played one of America's unexpectedly good fighters in War Thunder, the F4F Wildcat. Now, I know of the Wildcat's history and its reputation as a fantastic fighter, but it wasn't until some of you guys suggested I should play it that I realized what I was missing out on. Oh, wait, Lovely stop. stuff! <laughs> You're in. Subscribe for more and enjoy. Okay, first match of the day is Sinai. We are playing the F4F3 Wildcat. This is the first Wildcat in the game, which sits at battle rating 2.3. Now, why am I playing this one instead of the F4F4? <laughs> Got it in the end. The F4F4 has, yeah, two extra 50 cows. Sure, it's nice to have the extra firepower, but it sits at 3.0. So for me, it's kind of like, well, can I do without those extra 50 cows and have the 0.7 BR difference in my favor? And the answer to that is yes. Although there is a Corsair in here. Actually, why is the Corsair 2.7, but the F4F4 Wildcat is 3.0? The Corsair surely is arguably the better aircraft. Go on, lad. Hand crank. Where, where is it? Go on, lad. Hand crank those that landing gear. Go on. You can do it. 30 cranks. Go on. Up you go. Yeah. <laughs> my, guy, my guy has got a very jacked right arm as I'm looking down. No, not for that reason. Yes, our first crash of the day. Well done, ladies and gentlemen. I commend you all. <laughs> I feel like I'm in a birdcage. Bulbs? Huh? Something and bulbs. Why would it need that? Hydraulic lines. It's very weirdly laid out. Like, there's a lot of space on here they could have been utilizing, you know? Like, what if... It, you've got all this space here. Why wouldn't you put the small ones up the top and the bigger ones down below? That makes no sense to me. Oh, we're overheating already. Uh, I haven't got all the upgrades for this, but we've got the majority. So, just giving you some context before uh, we start getting into dogfights and stuff. Shulka! Is he going for the base or is he going for... Is his siren blaring? Depends which one it is. Sounds like it's not a B2. Alright, these guys are going to go for him. I'm not going to do that. I'm not wasting my um, my altitude. Nice! Well done. At least you got your points. You're going to die, but at least you got your points. Hurricane 88. 200. I, ah, I-301. Hmm. I remember when... Yeah, that's a, that's quite a dangerous little plane, that. It's not unbeatable, certainly. Right, MiG-3 is our first contact of the day. Who's going to go for who? Who's going to go for who? Okay, interesting. You've just sort of set yourself up for me here, mate. But all right, all right. rock with that. Uh, I can kind of... Out there. There we go. Lovely stuff. First kill of the day. Let's go. Yak 3 is, or Yak 1 is next. If you go up, I might be able to support. Yep, good hits. Come on. This turns really nice. It doesn't have a powerful engine, though. Nice. Yeah, he's going in. Lovely stuff. <laughs> Alright, let's cool this puppy down a little bit. Yep, you're going in. Still got 1,400 rounds of ammunition, which is very good. I-301, I really want to be trying to take out soon. 109 down below. Fantastic. We got the Yak-1. Very good. Corsair's diving. Okay. Yeah, I'm going to focus on the, on the I-301. He's basically, he's a red lag with a slightly more powerful engine and a, a slightly better flight model. So he's not super, super dangerous, but he's dangerous enough that I would want to, I, I kind of want to get him out of the sky. These guys, on the other hand, are very dangerous. You're going to heads on me. Do it. Please do it. Thank you. Good hit. Not today. Thank you. Right. What have we got going on down here? Okay. Basically, the entire <laughs> enemy team is after me. Alrighty. Oh, so they're going to be faster than me. They're going to be more powerful, but I can outturn a 109. So 
Actually, I want to draw the 109 away. Let's draw the 109 away from the lag so that we can do a one-on-one -on -one engagement with him. And roll. Cool. Let's go. Now, you should... Ah, are you an... Oh, you're an E1. Okay, well, I haven't got cannons to worry about. But I think you have got a similar turn time. <laughs> yeah, get out of here. Get out of here. Oh, I'm surprised I haven't played this earlier. Ah, your problem, though. All right. I don't know what you can do in terms of turn time. Are you on fire or are you just... No, you're not. Okay. All right. All right. Let's take you away like we did the others. I mean, you're kind of screwed because you want to be trying to glide back to base. Because you've probably got no engine. God, this thing turns nicely. How have I not played this more before? I've kind of skipped over this and gone straight for the for the Hellcat. Do I want to let? Do I want to be a nice person and let you go back to base? No. <laughs> Let's help this chap out. Let's cool down those engines. Who can we go for first? Who's going to be the better target? You. Come on. He's down. Let's go up. Very well done. And then there's a hind call to be dealing with. And then I think all that's left is the I-301. So let's drag him up for the Fokker. That should be an easy kill for you. Damn, you're not doing that. Go on. Go on, lad. Get him. Yeah, it'll get him. Right, cool. I-301's next. Go on. Extra points. Why not? He did absolute. Oh, no, I got his wing. He'll go down. Cool. Go on, Fokker. You can do that. You've got a lower stall speed than he does. You got him yet. Come on, lad. Unless you've got no ammunition. Which is entirely possible. Right. Is the I-301 going back to base or is he... Yes, he is. Seeing as he's put it in chat, he said he's got no ammo. So he's not really going to be a threat right now. Heinkel's down. Good stuff. All right. Let's loiter. Five kills in our first match already. Damn. Right. Now, is he going to... Is he going to back out or is he actually going to rearm? That's my question. Okay, I-301's climbing. Trying to get my team to uh, do some ground pounding. I've got to try and turn slowly not to have uh, vapor trails coming off my wingtips so he doesn't spot me. It may be that he sees the DB7 and not me. Right, he's far enough away from his base now for me to start thinking about dropping in on him he's fast i'm in a dive and i'm uh, not really catching him he'll have spotted me by now though we needed that like ten thousand feet just to try and even get close is he gonna head on us or is he going to yeah he is okay can i reverse on him quick enough though yes is the answer to that Come here. Ah, uh, now I'm slow, though. I've got to predict where these will go. Good hits. DB7's got to try and come towards me if he wants to stand a chance. Now I'm slow. I can't do anything. Yep. And now he can just run away from me. Well, we should win on ground points anyway. All right, I'm going to turn away, see if I can bait him. Come on, take the bait, 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 take the bait. Take the bait, take the bait, take the bait. Yep, thank you. He knew what I was doing. All right, cool. I'll just I'll just attack ground targets then. All right, I've got to be careful. I don't want to lose too much of my altitude here. In case he does decide to turn back around. Let's just confirm the match. Come on. Nice. Oh, oh, bad, bad, bad. Why did I do that? Why would, why did I do that? Why, why would... Whatever. Okay, Smolensk. Unfortunately, we actually lost that um, 
uh, that last match. I uh, unfortunately, with my mistake, the uh, the I three hundred one went on to kill the last two surviving aircraft. So we were so close to winning that. And unfortunately, because of my stupidity, uh, fair enough, it, it did lock at, at speed. But still, I should have known better, really, in that situation. And I didn't. So I lost us that match, which is unfortunate. But at least we know um, not to do that. <laughs> I appear to be an imposter. However, what I will say is that if we do come across that I-301 again, he is my primary target and I must get revenge for my, uh, for my mistake. Right, we've done a little bit of side climbing because that seems to be what helps us here. Uh, in terms of the teams, we are winning at the moment, but that's because we've had a pretty much a full lineup of BF109s, which is rather powerful. So there's not many of them left annoyingly yeah a lot of these guys down low are going to be doing their own thing i think i may try and focus the uh the bombers you know because i think the majority of the fighters are going to be gone right do i have the airspeed to get up to you i'm not sure i do but i'm gonna give it a go about there okay so let's get some more airspeed that <laughs> key 44 running for his life. <laughs> okay, are you going to try and dogfight me? I'm not sure. You can do. You're more than capable. Right, build up airspeed, build up airspeed, build up airspeed, and up we go. Hmm. Difficult. Hmm. It's quite hard to get up there, actually. His rear gunners are going to be able to start shooting at me pretty soon as well, I think. Oh, key 44. Nice. Well done. Come on, build up more airspeed. Up we go again. And about there. Yeah, I mean, it's doing some damage. But not enough, really. Uh, critical. I think that's where those extra 250 cows would really come in handy. Come on, build up your airspeed again. All right, up we go. Come on. Uh, about there. 50 cows are just doing nothing to this guy. Wow. Out there? Uh, kind of. I mean, he's losing bits, but I am just kind of feel like I'm eating away at him. All right, he's on fire, so I'll just back off a little bit and see if that burns him up. But he is Russian. Oh, okay, severe damage. Cool. All right, that works. B-18, you're next. B-18 is also the last alive. All right, cool. Nice. Have we been up to it here, then? We got a rank that does not matter. Uh, ah, yeah, we have. Okay, full up to you. That would make sense. Well, he's on fire as well. It looks like this one kill. Damn. Damn. Well, the 109 is going to get him. So let's see if we can quickly run down here and get some extra points. Light pillbox, light pillbox, medium tank. What are you? Is that 109 is definitely going to get that B18. Come on. Quickly get there. Nice. He's down. Let's line up on these guys. Yes! Well, that got some extra points at least. Is that B-18 actually going down? Or is he now running back to his airfield? That's my question. Good, he's down. What else have we got here? What else? Light pillbox? Have I got AP? I've got a little bit of AP, yeah. I think the B-18 is going down. I just assume he's in a flat spin. Yep, cool. Yeah, come on. Come on. Come on. Oh, bloody hell, that took a lot, didn't it? <laughs> okay, China Civil War. Nice. Okay, so don't side climb as much. Uh, <laughs> that seems to be the, uh, the key to getting some more kills in this because uh, first match obviously did really well. 
apart from the mistake. Second match, only one kill because I think we side climbed a little bit too much, so there wasn't enough enemies left. So now let's try and find a middle ground. Right, let's send it. Why am I on my own? Hello? Oh, they're here. Okay, cool. Come on, get your fat butt off that runway. Right, let's head over in this direction a little bit. Stick it at a 15, and that'll do. Have we been up tiered slightly here again? I think we have. We're 2.3. Yeah, we definitely have been up tiered here a little. <laughs> I mean, for a 2.3 plane, it climbs okay. But uh, when you're getting up tiered, <laughs> you're a little bit slow. I think if we try and play around 10 to 15,000 feet, that's probably where our safe zone is going to be, I reckon. G4M1. Nice. Nice. Yak1, 109, J22B. Well, Buffalo, Buffalo. Uh, okay. Well, we are ta taller. Higher than them. CW21, obviously, we know how dangerous that can be. Corsair and 109 up in space. Holy crap. Spitfire, 88. Okay. I wish I could have a lower fuel amount on this. 29 minutes being the minimum is crazy. Surely the minimum should be whatever I want it to be. JU88. Okay. Okay. Although we do have multiple friendlies up here with us that may get him before I even have a chance. So my better option may honestly... Oh no, they kind of don't care. All right. All right. That changes the game a bit more now. These guys... P2, MS10, these guys that are RTB. Is the 88 going after the P2? What's going on here? Okay, I'll tell you what. Let's try and jump on the back of this 22. Those guys are occupied. All right, let's keep altitude. Or airspeed rather than altitude. All right, what have we got going on here? You're there. Oh, hello, Yak. Didn't even see you there. J22 is my target. In fact, multiple J-22s are going to be my target by the looks of it. 400 mile an hour. Got to be careful not to lock up. He's down. Not today. No. Another J-22. Not today, brother. Sorry. Them's the rules. MS-410 next. Don't normally like doing that, but we are a little bit outnumbered at the moment. Now, it entirely depends how quickly I can get to him before he reaches their main airfield. So I'm not playing that game. We're going to be severely outnumbered soon. And he's going to be in anti-air range. Bloody hell, he's quick. You know what? I'm not doing that. I'm gaining altitude instead. All right, we've got a buffalo, a yak, and I know there's a Spitfire over there as well. 109 will be taken off. He'll be repaired by now. MS-410 has just landed. So that's one, two, three, four, five fighters to deal with and i'm the only fighter outside of the pe3 which is not a fighter okay cool altitude is going to be our friend here i need them to come up to me not the other way around i've got 15 minutes to dispatch them spitfire yak yak could be trade that's either going to be water or it's going to be fuel if it's water that that works in my favor oh well done p2 okay now there's only one two Four to be dealing with that evens the odds a little okay they're both lower than me but i've got to be considerate because they're going to be off they're going to be off the runway by now okay let's give it a go okay engine back on right if you can zoom climb to me that would be absolutely fantastic well you've just done me a massive favor thank you very much if i could aim right back up Okay, 109. Okay, let's turn around. We do have the altitude over the 109. Got to be careful about ammo as well. All right, come on. And the MS-410. All right, three, two, one. Oi, you good, bro. Oh, okay, cool. Your engine's damaged. That's good. Gain altitude again. All right, MS-410's next. Can you... Okay, cool. Right, you've got 20 mils, so I'm not doing that. Nope, not today. Nope. Cool. Can we get the buffalo? Whoa! What are you doing there? 
Jesus. Okay. I don't know if I can outturn the MS410 or not. Right. Let's try it. Let's get him into a, into a fight. I don't know. The one, 109 I'm not really worried about. It's the 410. Right. Where is he? Where is he? Where is he? Right. That's bad. Come on. 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 Not today. Ugh. Nope. Nope. Come here. Come here. Give me landing or take off. Come here. You're going in. You're going in, right? Oh. You're in. <laughs> Hell yeah. <laughs> Get out of here. Right. Altitude is needed. <laughs> yes. Right, the buffalo and the yak. Okay. Okay, 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 okay. I'm damaged, but I'm certainly not in a position where I can't fight them if I... Mm, if I need to. Go on, P3. Even out the odds. There's 10 minutes. 10 minutes and the tickets. Okay. Go away. You're not going to ruin my match, thank you. Right, that's their airfield. So what I need to do is I need to roughly go this direction. Right, there's one. One's already taken off. I'm going to guess that's the yak. wonder if we can maybe get him into a false sense of security. Oh, so, oh I'm out of ammo. I've got to go back to base. He's got better engine performance than I do. Good. Yes, go for the P3. Do that. And then it's just the buffalo. If we get this... If we get this kill. P3, come on! <sighs> He's on fire. He's on fire. He's on fire. I've got to focus on the buffalo only. That is big dubs. Well done, P3. Well done. Right, just one more. Because even if he doesn't, it, he'll knock him out. I reckon that yak's going down. If I die to this buffalo, I will never forgive myself. Right, come on. Come on. Come on. He can outturn me. But I have got the engine power. Oh, yeah, that'll do. <laughs> oh, yes. <laughs> Let's go. Let no! What? No! No! What? What? What just happened? What is this? Oh. Fuck. Oh. <laughs> you guys, you Jesus Christ. Bruh. Okay. <laughs> You're rewarded with a game like that only for Gaijin to screw you over with ground points. Well, I don't get, there was loads. There was loads of tickets left. Why did they just randomly disappear like that? I think I, I think it was a rigged match, guys. Rig <laughs> rigged match. They saw that it was going too well for me. They saw it was going too well and they're like, nah, bro. <laughs> you, you ain't having the win on this one. I'm so disappointed. Oh, man. That sucks. Bro has found that he has lasers. I can't tell if we've been up tiered here or not. Don't think we have we might be like two seven maybe three oh i don't think it's too badly me 410 what br is that that's three three isn't it nice fantastic a team kill already on the enemy team brilliant news right now we got the heinkel up there but the hurricane might get to him before i do so i'm going to bank in this general direction look at that mess of planes down there that's what we like to see I just want to send it and go get involved in this verbal. Whatever happens, happens. That's probably the most that Sakin has ever climbed to altitude, and now he's got nothing to shoot at. Right. 109. You're my first target. Actually, no, you're not, because you're looping downward. Let me work this out. Let me figure out what's going on here. All right, cool. All right. All right, let's go full speed. Let's get you first. You're hit. Yep, you're... 
wing has fallen off. Let's go up. Cool. And round. P63. Probably the next target. Right, you going up? Yep, you are. Perfect. Right, you're damaged, but you're not out. So let's confirm you out. Get out of it. Mine. Dice, he's down. 109's next. You have really set yourself up for me. What are you going to do here? Because... Get out of it. It's mine. Right, you can do whatever you want now. Cool. So. What else is there? Uh, I'll just confirm the kill. Why not? There we go. Cool. Right, Heinkel. You, my good sir. Oh, next on my list. That is a big column. I mean, there's two left. They're both bombers. One. All right, I'll go deal with this guy. So we now know I might be heading to that, that airfield with no AA protection. Yeah, he is. I can see him. I will wait for him to take off. I'm not going to strafe him while he's on the runway. I'll do it when, they, when they're landing. But not when they're about they're repairing or taking off, generally. Unless I'm very, very outnumbered. I need to reduce the numbers a little. Get him, get him some points for taking off. Right, cut throttle, roll, pitch. You're going to really struggle to get above those trees. Damn, you did, though. <laughs> in he goes <laughs> battle of britain moment <laughs> nice four kills not as good as our last match but at least this one we're winning so i will take that victory i'm really enjoying the wildcat i can't believe i haven't played it more i think it's because of what was that glitch i think it's just because again i've just gone straight to the hellcat okay caban nice it's not the small. Ah, it's not the small version. Like bleh, boo, that's okay. Ah, we're a little, little bit late. That's not good. Let's go. At least we have got a bigger lobby this time around, which is nice. This is the fun thing about low tier: is that everyone just pounces on the first thing that's low, <laughs> which means that then I'm stuck up here having to deal with about ten thousand fighters. Quite a lot of the enemy team is already gone, and I haven't really spotted that many of them. I mean, the cloud layer won't be helping that, but still. Yak 1, P4. Okay, now they're starting to show up. Where, are, where do they actually come from? To the right. Oh, I'm just going to go over in that direction. That's where they all are, so. Look at all those chickens. That P40 is done for, pretty much. Nice. Okay, we have got pretty much free reign over these guys. Let's go over in this direction, I reckon. I mean, we could try and drop on that guy, but that's boring. Oh, are you going to zoom climb to me? Oh, do it. Oh, I got a hit on you. You didn't get a hit on me. Yeah, nice. Thank you very much. Uh, camera, please. Camera, thank you. Come on. Yep, you're done for. Lovely. Up we go. Yak1 is my next target. Nice. He's down. Good stuff. P40 is also going for the Yak1. That's not good. Whoa. What's going on here then? He's down. Good. I-153. Come here. He's down as well. 109's the final aircraft to take out and then this will be game over as well and he's down wow so the f4f wildcat an unexpectedly good aircraft um i always knew it was good but i didn't think it was still this good uh i always sort of just jumped to the hellcat straight away as soon as i unlocked it so do i recommend you play this aircraft Absolutely, but specifically the F3 model. Do not bother with the F4. I can't see why you would go for the F4 at 3.0 for the extra 250 cows versus this, which is 2.3. Um, 
So I would highly suggest that you give this aircraft a go. That's it for this video. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, please leave a like below and subscribe to the channel for more content like this. Until next time, take care.